Hey there, I'd like to show you something new that I'm carrying along with me on my hikes now. And it's this rechargeable battery by Phoenix. It's a AA substitute that's USB rechargeable. 1600 milliamp hours. It's a pretty good substitute for a normal AA battery. And it's actually quite a bit lighter. A Duracell battery, you know, normal Duracell that I've been carrying around, those are typically uh, 25 grams ish and uh, this battery comes in at about 19 grams so it's, it's a five six gram weight savings it's not quite as light as say the energizer lithium batteries these guys weigh roughly 15 grams but for four more grams i can recharge this over and over again off my normal battery bank that i carry to charge my phone so let's take a closer look at this. It's got a USB port tucked right in the top part of the battery. And what's nice, you can't see it, but underneath that white ring, there is also an LED. While it's charging, the LED glows red, and when it's complete, it turns blue. It takes a few hours to charge up, and I've tossed one in my Zebra light, and I've been using it for the past few weeks. It seems to work pretty well. One thing I will mention in the Zebra Light, it's got multiple uh, settings. I've done a review on that light in the past, and it's got a low, a medium, and a high, and each one of those has several sub settings. In the high mode, this battery, it overheats, it has a self-protection circuit in the top, so the battery actually turns itself off when too much current is drawn from it. In application with the Zebra Light, it will trip that safety feature in the high mode, but in the low mode and the medium mode, it seems to work fine. I typically hike, if I'm hiking at night, I will use the low mode in its highest setting. Uh, medium is too much light for me, as is uh, high is way too much light. If anybody has some experience with these type of chargeable batteries, Please leave a note down below, I'd be interested in uh, hearing your experience with these.